But uh, but yeah, he got like this super big jet, uh, like like an airliner that he can he flies around with, like presidential shit. Who Drake? Yeah. What does that have to do with anything? I'm just saying, like you said, he was an ambassador yeah. for Indians. No, no, not for Indians. It's amazing. It's his private plane, and since he's Canadian, they wrote Air Canada on the side. It's yeah. amazing. No, it's he, he called it the Air and he's a regular dude, so he lets other people fly on it yeah. with him. <laughs> Even, that would be he even waits in line. No, no. <laughs> uh, actually, he made his own airline. I think thirty-four-year-old Canadian rapper and private plane aficionado Drake continues to live the sweet life with his own private seven sixty-seven plane. It's like a huge. It's not like your regular everyday private jet. This is like his own uh, school bus plane. Okay, so a uh, school bus plane. Well, what you know those mean? bus planes, yeah. like uh, the the name for like them, like Airbus. Yeah, there you go, yeah. Airbus. Thank you. I have an idea. So if you remember, Poseidon used to have a podcast in French with your friend Annabelle. Yeah. And then Annabelle had a good story about this high tech, um, young crypto guy or whatever that would fly these escorts out to different places on his private jet. Yeah. Here's the plan: you befriend that guy, you guys bond over hookers. Then we have a friend by association with a private jet, so that we can fly around this country performing with the private jet. I like this. Yeah. And you already know what he's into. Yeah. Same stuff you're into. Yeah. Worst case scenario, you suck his dick. Get us on yeah. that. Yeah, plane. that's not gonna happen. That have, you gotta be a team player. <laughs> Bro, I'd rather walk to the next venue. <laughs> Imagine too, like if she had a dude a couple of years ago that was rich because of crypto. How rich he is now. Uh, yeah, bro. that was last year. Yeah. He's yeah. rolling in he's rolling yeah. in the sauce, bro. So you need to become his friend. He needs to fund our entire tour. Yeah. And he f- comes with us, he flies around, and you and him could talk about the, the horror game. Yeah. And you can start another podcast with him. There's one issue. I don't know who this man is. You have to go back to your old podcast partner. You know what you first. should do, just uh, since you don't know who he is exactly? Just start sucking off any rich guy you <laughs> yeah, see yeah. and hope for the best. And sometimes there's those rich guys that they go on those rally shows where they pretend they're regular guys and they go into the workplace. Yeah. So you have to blow some regular dudes too. Yeah, because those are the richest. I got to check all of them. guys on this guy. I got to yeah. check all of them. Yeah. <laughs> look at fucking Elon Musk. He doesn't look rich. When yeah. you see him, he looks like a, just a weird... Autistic guy. Autistic so you have to start guy. blowing autistic dudes. Too. Ah, yeah. shit. And if anybody asks, what are you doing? There's police or anything. You just tell them, sir, I'm trying to I'm trying to get this tour off the ground. <laughs> <laughs> I'm an artist. <laughs> you ever heard of Drake? <laughs> Trying to explain it away like that. God damn. And there's no age limit. So even old businessmen, they might want to help. Oh, yeah. You know young what boys too? No, not young boys. Bro. No, oh. that's disgusting. That's just weird. There's no rich young boys. No. When you said there's no age limit, I heard there's no AIDS limit. <laughs> Blow all the AIDS patients. <laughs>